So a few things to know about this wrap is that it goes, it tucks under here, it tucks under here, and the pressure relief cuts that start about here and go all the way to here and on the other side as well. And also the pressure relief cuts here, so your vinyl doesn't wrinkle. Now, one thing that I'd like to emphasize on right now is how to align this and notice that these are three separate pieces and you would want to align this the end of this corner to the middle piece here where the cut starts so let's see what happens now the other thing is that because this thing Scene, uh, we cannot do a uh, wetting style, so just lay down, it will slide, it will not stick until you press on it. So just be very careful to not press the vinyl so it doesn't stick. So you can first align it properly and then move on to the actual installation. So, first, I'll align this corner here again. I'm looking where this middle piece starts and I kind of want to align it to this and I'll press it a little bit so it stays kind of put and I'll use my other hand to position the vinyl kind of I'm trying to center it here And now I'll just go through the entire length, make sure it's pretty good. Uh, I see it should come a little bit here. Okay. Yeah, I think that's it. Now, the next part is that we want to remove all the air bubbles from under the vinyl on this flat surface. So I'll use a squeegee. It would come. It would come with the with the vinyl, and I'll do like this. Make sure to apply pressure so you don't leave any bubbles. You basically want to see the border uh, of the spoiler before the vinyl tucks in and you want to make sure that there are no bubbles near the border. This is where they usually go. I'll just push it a little bit so I can see the border clearly. and verify that there are no bubbles. Okay. So, the first step I will do is start in the middle, here. Now just use my fingers for this part. So just use your fingers, push it down, slowly. Make sure you apply pressure so you don't leave any bubbles. And here you'll notice there are tiny cuts. Those are pressure relief cuts. 
so that the vinyl doesn't wrinkle. Or at least it doesn't wrinkle as much as it would without them. I'll leave this last part for now and I'll just do the other the other half. And again, I'll leave the, the very last for now. <clears throat> now, I'll use the squeeze again and I'll go under the vinyl to make sure that everything sticks. Now, let's do the other part here. This one is easier. Again, start from the middle and you can just do like this faster. Leave the last inch or two. I'll just run again with my fingers to make sure that it's well stuck. Now let's do the corners. What I want to do is separate these three pieces and first I'll press on the middle one then I'll press on the one that's near the window here and make sure you press really hard to avoid wrinkles and now I'll press this one like this and that's your corner now let's go do this on the other side. Separate these. The middle one first, then the back one. Press hard. And now let's do this one. Beautiful, that's it.